Hey, uh, sorry about the, the wait on update 10. I think this is it, update 10. Uh, geez, I, I made a couple of videos. I just didn't put them on. I just skipped right to this one. I was busy. I didn't, didn't have enough time. I had to work a there and stuff in school. I don't know. I just didn't get around to making a video and putting it online, so... I'm gonna made this video. I I had this I made another light right here. Ooh, it's bright. It's uh just a, a cardboard box. It's all tin foil on the inside. And uh I had two sockets, one there, but I took that one out and I used it built another light with it. Uh, that one right here, I had two, I think it was two, uh, I can't remember how many watts they were, but they were cool white, but now I only have one, uh, 42 watt cool white CFL light bulb. So I had this under here, just to grow this up. Um, I'm going to take this whole thing off. Once I take, uh, the whole top of this off, I'm going to put another socket right there and I'm going to put a soft light in so it's a dual spectrum so uh, so I'll have sort of flower and grow just like this I'm going to take that off once I get out get the money, buy some stuff and rebuild the light I just took that out, I built another light with it but that's that light and right here I that was the I started at G's a long time ago this is my cat and the plant. I made some videos. But like I said, I didn't put them on. I didn't have time, but that's my cat and the plant. <laughs> I know it sounds crazy, cat and it, but that is it. I mean, it's pretty nice. I bring it outside every single day. Put it in my greenhouse and let it grow right there underneath. Give it some real sun for a chain. Down here, I got another catnip in the hydroponic but that's just stress the plant's no good it's, it's crap it's been in there it's just burnt out I just plucked it out pulled it right out of the soil I was been in this guy out. but I was going to throw it away I just decided to try to put it in there but no it's crap it's no good down there I got a sunflower seed I don't know I just I bring that outside too I just uh experimented with it. Ah, geez, I had a couple of ripe tomatoes already. We took some off and we ate them. They're, they're pretty good. Uh, they're a bit sour though from the nutrients. I'm gonna, I'm going to uh, sw switch uh, the nutrients to organics. It's gonna be good. I'm gonna put organic fertilizer in there instead of the little nutrients crap from the Aerogram place. There's another ripe one in behind here. There's a couple of ripe ones there. These are golden harvest, right? And what we have right here is uh, my pea plant. I planted in here. I planted a bunch of stuff in here. I just had to took out the avocado seeds. I can't remember what video I made last, but and these are all radishes and chives, which are stressed. I think there was a bit of nutrients from the fertilizer left in the watering can that I left in there and burnt them out. So I make sure that I rinse the watering can out before I water these. So these are my radishes. Down there too. I got my pea plant. I built a trellis for it. I'm going to bring it up in the water. I bring these outside, but once this attaches to there, the pea plant, I'm just going to leave it inside. And once I got my other bulb in there, I'm going to put a computer fan to cool them, to cool the lights. Once I get one. <laughs> but yeah, that's, uh, that's pretty much it for here. I'll show you the other lights and stuff I built over here on the side of my room. Okay, I'll just turn this on. Uh, okay, there we go. So what we got here, I'll just turn some of these on. Uh, I built built this light right here. It's uh 
42-watt CFL cool white bulb. It's uh, like a just a wing reflector kind of thing I made. But uh, yeah, I made that. It's pretty cool. I got, I'm going to put some plants in there. I had the other ones under there. I got 72 plants in here started. I started them today under the fluorescence. They're only T12s. They suck for growing, but that's all I got. Start the seeds under. And I'll move them under this stuff. And right here, I built this light. I got it uh, on an idea on YouTube off a guy. Uh, the user... Yeah, that's him. And, uh, yeah, uh, it's a good light. I have just right there, what, how many watts are these? Yeah, they're only 23 watts there, but I'm putting the 42 watts in there to the cool light once I buy them. I made some hydroponic systems right here <laughs> and a kitty litter box, but that's all I got. And the net pots, uh, oh, let me put this down. Just uh, uh, plastic cups, and I melted holes in them. That's all the same, all the net pots I got. Um, that's what I got there for hydroponic system. I'm going to be starting them soon. I got this big, huge one, a uh, tow tub. Here's the pump. I got two prongs. I got a divider. It's going in here. My battery's going to run out of my camera soon, so i got to hurry up. This is another one. Three liters it holds. Got an air gun thing and just a homemade yogurt cup thing that burns holes into it. And yeah, that's going to be air pump, deep water culture. Same this, this, and this. They're all deep water culture. And this is my grow setup in here. Um, yeah. Uh, I'll quickly turn on this light too. Ooh. It takes a, a few minutes for the CFOs to heat up to their full extent. But yeah, this is my uh, grow area. That's what I got going on, so I'll have you updated with some hopefully spread of plants. So that's it for update 10.